because at MasterWorks we have quite a few people that do bodybuilding competitions, you know, people ask me, oh, shall I do a lot of posing, you know, after training, shall I do? You know, in reality, it's, in a way, yes and no. I mean, if somebody's been training and he trains a lot, the pausing is not really going to do a lot to the muscle. Um, apart from if you're competing, it helps you practice the move, it helps you practice for the comparisons you're going to do. But for say somebody that doesn't compete and is probably never going to compete, you know, pausing the muscle um, for somebody that doesn't train at all and flexing the muscle, then it does do something. But for somebody that's training, comes in the gym and dance, you know, 15, 10, 12 sets of, of biceps and, and chest and, and legs, you know, doing a little bit of pausing is not really going to help them to that extent to develop or do anything to the muscle. I, I would say and I would suggest if somebody has the time to do that, I'd rather they did stretching, especially on the lower back and, and buttocks and, and thighs and hamstrings, because I come across a lot of people that have a lot of problems with their knees, with their lower backs, uh, and the major thing that creates that problem is the lack of stretching. And learning to do a few stretches, which is quite easy to do, for five, ten minutes every night, instead of pausing, I think it would be more beneficial. Um, so that's my advice. <laughs>